this modeling agency immediately um, when I started hijab most of my friends were like they were thinking I can con uh, continue it because I was so speed and I always wear short, short things and then they think that some people even tell me that they dream that I once removed the hijab so I attend one modeling show and I saw um, the modeling uh, show was for non-hijabs but I saw only one hijab there and I was like I was feeling like this person is um, odd in the midst and all of them are non-hijabs they will not give her the chance to win and that is how it goes she didn't win so I said how about we have a modeling agency for hijabs only since there are a lot of modeling agencies in the Gambia which are for non-hijabs so that is why I decided to open this modeling agency I want to promote modesty and I want um, young kids like me young girls to, to be wearing the hijab, even not the hijab, but to wear modest outfits because you know these short things, you don't even feel comfortable with it. So I want to uh, motivate people to do it and also the designers in the Gambia for, to boost their fashion uh, industry. Um, the fact that it is promoting the modesty of, of, of hijabs, the fact that covering ourselves makes us beautiful. Even some people, they're not hijabs, but they realize that when, when they're covering themselves up, they feel happy and they feel that they're, they're elegant enough to walk anyhow they feel like in the street and they have the courage and the confidence to, to, to walk around and be happy. The fact that this agency would be able to promote modesty and elegance that's why I was inspired to, to join and be a part of the change that they want to make. The fact that we are, we're wearing the veils and the society will be looking at us that we shouldn't be on the runway, it's wrong. Because we are women, we are women and we are human beings. And the fact that we can also show our, our way of dressing to be fashionable, to show that we're also part of the community. Although we are covering ourselves, covering ourselves can be beautiful and we can enjoy it and we can also, also get, get uh, income from it. Well, I'm not actually a uh, hijabi, but I saw that the way people dress now, especially the hijabs, actually nicer than the way other people dress because I see they're comfortable and you fit in everywhere. I think this is going to be that extra push to actually make me a hijabi and I would love to because it's actually not an easy, it's not easy, the decision is not easy to become a hijabi because... Uh, I love to see people are like, making the difference positive in the society and when she proposed to men, um, I look into it and I say like it's the same thing, it's the same fashion and so why not? I need to support. There's no hard feelings. I just need to support and she's a young girl coming up and coming up with such uh, ideas which is great, you know, bringing hijabs into fashion. What's the difference is like, I don't see the difference, sorry, um, because if you look at Dubai, they have Dubai Hijab Fashion Week. Even in America, they have Hijab Fashion Week. And all of Iraq, the Emirates, they have Emirates Kingdoms, they have Hijab Fashion Week. It doesn't mean like being doing a fashion show, it doesn't mean like people should think negative. Because remember, it's clothes you're wearing, and clothes is fashion. So, what is fashion? Fashion is what is happening in the streets what you're wearing, what people are wearing and stuff. So we shouldn't discriminate because it's also a fashion too. So we shouldn't have that negative mind saying, oh, I'm a hijab and I'm doing a runway show or I'm doing a publicity and stuff. No, that is wrong. It's fashion because it's clothes you're wearing, it's off it. People 
from different source who just text me and be like, what you are doing is not a right thing. Some are saying it is not good in Islam and all that. I told them Arab countries are doing it. I check um, YouTube, I check Google, I check a lot of places and a lot of um, Muslim countries are doing this. It's just to wear what people are wearing, the Muslim way of dressing to show the world how beautiful it is. So I think it is not a, a bad thing. Though. Recently it's 40, 40 girls right now. So if I have 30 it's good because not all of them can be um, models. But we will not uh, eliminate any, any of them because during our casting we are going to choose the people that will be uh, runway models so that they can take part in our event. But the rest will still go on training so that they can be professional models. This coming November, I'm planning to launch the modeling agency together with Hijab Fashion Week. And I'll be doing Hijab Fashion Week every year.